hello friends welcome to coding host youtube channel in this video i will show you program for adding an element in 1d array in java let's take an example that we have a array and in the array we have to add element 25 at position 3 before writing the program first we have to understand the aim properly that if they are asking us to add element at index or only position because position start from 1 but index start from 0 in the array so you can see we have this array which have 5 elements that means the array size is 5 and we have to add the element 25 here at the position 3 but we know that in array we can only access any element by using index so we can only add this element by using the index value so index value will be position minus 1 so it means 3 minus 1 equal to 2 so we have to add element 25 at index 2 but we know that array size cannot be increased or decreased or if I directly replace 25 at index 2 in this case we will get 25 at index 2 but our element 30 will get lost so what we can do here is that we have to make new array and the length of this new array will be array length of the previous array plus 1 so that means this new array length will be 6 because our previous array length was 5 so in this array we can add 25 at index 2 and after the rest of the element so by using a new array we are not losing any element so first uh, i will write the program and then i will explain you so in the program first i will make the previous array with size 5 int a equal to 10 20 30 40 and 50 after that int element equal to 25 and int position equal to 3 after that int index equal to position minus 1 after that i will make a new array int b equal to new int a dot length plus 1 and after that i will take a for loop for int i equal to 0 and j equal to 0 and i less than b dot length and i plus plus j plus plus and in this i will write if i equal equal to index so p of i equal to element and j minus minus else b of i equal to a of j and after that i will take one more for loop to print the element of new array for int i equal to 0 i less than b dot length and i plus plus and in this i will print b of i plus operator and space let's run this program so you can see in the output we are getting 10 20 25 30 40 and 50 and our element 25 is at position 3 so let's see how this program is working so in the program i have taken an array a and its length is 5 and it has 5 elements 10 20 30 40 and 50 after that we have to add the element 25 after that we have int position equal to 3 and after that we have to take index so index equal to position minus 1 so 3 minus 1 is 2 so in this index variable we have to after that int b equal to new int a dot length plus 1 so i have made a new array b in which length is a dot length plus 1 
so 5 plus 1 is 6 so the length of this new array is 6 after that I have taken a for loop for int i equal to 0 and j equal to 0 so I have taken two variables i and j and I am using this i variable for this array b and this j variable for this array a to access their indexes so initial value of i is 0 and j is 0 after that i less than b dot length so i is 0 so it is less than 6 so our condition is true and we get inside our loop so if i equal equal to i dx so i is 0 and index value is 2 so i is not equal to i dx so our condition is false and we will not execute the statements inside this so it will execute the else statement so b of i equal to a of j so in the i variable we have 0 so it means array b at index 0 we are storing the value of a of j j is 0 so at index 0 we have element 10 in the array a and we are storing this element in array b so now this array b has element 10 at index 0 after that i plus plus and j plus plus so i will become 1 and j will also become 1 after that we again run our loop so it will check that i is less than b dot length so i is 1 which is less than 6 so our condition is true and we again get inside our loop so if i equal to index so i is 1 and index is 2 so i is not equal to index so our condition is false and it will not execute the statements inside it so it will execute the else statements so b of i equal to a of j so in the array a at index 1 we have 20 so we will store this element 20 in the b of i and i is also 1 so at index 1 in array b we will store element 20 after that i plus plus and j plus plus so i and j will become 2 now we again run our loop so i is less than b dot length so i is 2 which is less than 6 so our condition is true so if i equal equal to i dx so i is 2 and index is also 2 so our condition is true and it will execute b of i equal to element so at index 2 in array b we will store the element 25 20 5 and after that j minus minus after that i plus plus and j plus plus so i will become 3 but j will become 2 so i have taken this j minus minus so the index value in array a will go back to 1 because we don't want that array index of this both arrays will run at same indexes because we also have to add 25 element at some index in array b if i not write j minus minus it will skip the value 30 and it will only store 40 and 50 element so that's why we also have to take j minus minus in this if statement and after that we again run our loop so i is less than b dot length so i is 3 and it is less than b dot length so our condition is true so it will check that if i equal to index so i is 3 and index is 2 so in this whole program this if statement will only execute once and it has already executed so that means it will not execute anymore and this else statement will only execute for the rest of the array indexes so we are not checking this if statement and we are only running this else statement so b of i equal to a of j so b of i is here and a of j 
j is 2 so it means index 2 so at a 2 index we have 30 and we are storing this element 30 in array b at index 3rd so now we have 30 here and after that i plus plus and j plus plus so now i will become 4 and j will become 3 after that we again run our loop so we check that i is less than b dot length so i is 4 and is less than 6 so our condition is true and we will execute our else statement b of phi equal to a of j so b of phi is here at index 4 and a of j is here at index 3rd and here we have element 40 and we are storing this element 40 at here index 4 in the array b so now here at index 4 in array b we have element 40 and after that i plus plus and j plus plus so now i will become 5 and j will become 4 after that we again run our loop and we check that i is less than a b dot length so i is 5 and is less than 6 so our condition is true and it will execute this else statement b of 5 equal to a of j so i is 5 so at index 5 in array b is here and a of j so j is 4 in the array a element at index 4 is 50 so we will store 50 here in the array b at index 5 after that i plus plus and j plus plus so now i will become 6 and j will become 5 after that we again run our loop so i is less than b dot length so i is 6 which is not less than 6 so our condition is false and our loop will break and after that we will print the values of our array b and in the output we will get 10 20 25 30 40 and 50 and we get 25 at position 3 so this is how we can write a program for adding an element in 1d array in java thank you